Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Epis. Huh. Uh, let's see how this works. I hope I didn't underdo the sounds. I probably did. Fuck my life. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Oh, my controller turned off. How brilliant. Da -da 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 -da. Excellent. Looks like we've got everything where it needs to be. Let's go ahead and do our teleport thing. Seven twenty P sixty. Good. Everything's going like it should. Lovely. All right. Where did we leave off? I think. Oh no, I'm just a dummy. Let's see. Hello, Reaper. How are you? Hey, Reaper, can you do me a favor? If you hear anything funny with the audio, please let me know. I'm trying to fix everything since I went back to OBS. So if anything sounds imbalanced, or something is not properly being heard to your knowledge, please let me know, okay? Because I'm really bad at trying to use my own audio to fi figure it out. The upshot of switching back to OBS means things should be a lot more stable going forward. Once I get everything sorted out again, that is. That's okay. If you just notice something a bit funny, or think I could adjust some of the volume settings in any way, let me know. That's all I need. Apparently I'm still fucking blepping. But yeah, music versus my voice. Shall we be on our way to Annex Trine, then? I would not have the dragons think that we've forgotten our bargain. question is, do I want to play more with Dancer, Warrior, or Gunbreaker? I have no idea. But yeah, Reaper, like I told you earlier, I went and picked up the Dual Sense. Um, so far, it feels really nice neat in my hands. Thou art returned, little one. Hast thou abandoned thine ill-conceived contest with the Nath? Nay, my friend, we returned in triumph. By Thel's hand was the beastman's god, Lord Ravana, laid low. In his overconfidence, the primal swore to withdraw his followers from your lands in the event of his defeat. A promise I believe he will keep. The Nath shall trouble you no longer. The deity slain, then. 
How didst thou contend with his biting blades? The particulars matter not. Thou hast fulfilled thy promise, and I shall fulfill mine. Attend me, mortals. Hie you into the deepest riches of the morn, and there you shall find Halo, the altar from which you may begin your ascent to the summit of Psalm Al. But be fairly warned, the minions of Nidhogg shall not lightly suffer your presence on that sacred mount. By your struggles within the cavern shall I judge your party possessed of sufficient fortitude to proceed. We shall not disappoint you, Vidofnia. If memory serves, the Cavern of Morn has entered from the second floor of the central tower. Let us begin the climb. Boing. Sturgeons, Sturgeons everywhere. Nah, it's no Halo 5. I am going to need Raptor because it'd be nice to go ahead and do the, uh, the encounters as a group. Hmm, I sense a great power within you. Yes, you will make a suitable adversary. Our younglings must learn the hardships of battle. You will find them just beyond the tower. Go quick and hold nothing back. Doodles Reaper! Ya butt! <laughs> Be safe! Yes, me! You too! I know I'm a butt, and I freely admit it. Come on, give me the ether current. There we go. Give it to me. <coughs> so she wants me to beat up a bunch of pick squeak dragons. I don't understand. Man is not fit to battle with dragons. Nevertheless, I will do as father asks. Chocobo is now my dance partner. How dare you do such a thing to Calm Gun? You may have beaten him, but the game ends here. What trickery is this? Tell that they can make a mockery of me and my brothers. Get smacked, bitch.
Here we go. Fine. Fine. Let's go report to the Daddy Dragon, and then it's on to the next dungeon! On a lovely Monday morning. Do not worry, my intention is not to foster ill relations, but to teach. The younglings grow too prideful, doubting the strength of men, but thanks to you, they now understand. Hello. Pass. I see your raptor. Hello. By the way, how's my audio sound, raptor? On the stream, at least. Well, yeah, I was about to say there is a delay, but that's between reality and the actual stream. Yeah, I just need to make sure that uh, the sound is properly balanced, is the thing. Compared to you, the game is soft. Should I bring it up? Some. Not much, but a little. Uh, let's go up by maybe three decibels or so. How's that? Should be good now, right? And I'm not sure. Are you coming through? I think you are. By maybe yes, you one. Are. You're about on par with me, I think. So that's good. I'm just gonna cap it a little bit lower for the Discord audio, though. That good. That should be good. Yay! Now the game's not even with you when you're speaking. And it's still soft enough for you can still loud enough for you can hear everything, every note. Okay, excellent. And I'm coming through quiet, but still audible. And how's now for you? Test one, two, three. Now I'm about on par with you. Alright, so that's parody. Good. Seems good. I'm debating whether I really want to harass myself with this or not. Harass yourself? What do you even mean? There are tombstones. The Mughal tombstones are back. What are the Mughal tombstones good for? Um, you've seen my bomb mount, you've seen my Kamui mount, you've seen my Drake mount, you've seen all of those strange little, uh, fancy mounts I have. Uh. They have four new ones out. One is a Tyrannosaur, which you've been running past. Okay. There is a Blissful Kamui, a Magitek Predator, and a Hang on, Blissful Kamui. Heed me now, children of man. The domain you seek to enter hath not been visitors of your kind in nigh a thousand years. Though I freely grant you passage, your presence will not be welcomed. To my kin, this mountain is revered as holy ground and resting place both. Where are the minions of Nidhogg during your ascent? 
but tis certain they shall take great offense to your intrusion. We are grateful for your warnings, Vidafnia. My final words are for thee, Dragoon. Have care to keep the soul and power thou wieldest in check, lest it breed further despair. Estinian? The way is open, let us not tarry. A moment. Shall we blindly forge on, knowing the dangers that await us? Human herself is said to guard this peak. I do not fear Nidhogg's consort. Any dragon foolish enough to bar a path shall feel the sting of my lance. Spoken like a true butcher, need I remind you that we come to parley in peace? Let us be clear, heretic. It was to save Ishgard and her people that I first lent my support to this doubtful venture, and tis for their sake that I now go to speak with this with Hreisvalger. But I have said nothing of Tiona. Should the opportunity present itself to rid my people of its deadliest enemies, I shall take it. That is my duty as the Azur Dragoon. Your word on redemption. We will accomplish nothing by bickering. If we are to meet with Freysvalga, our path leads up the mountain. We shall defend ourselves if attacked, but avoid conflict wherever possible. What other choice do we have? Bipis. Psalm all accessible. That is a level 53 dungeon. I just entered the Praetorium. Oh, you just started one? Yeah. Eh, bugger. <sighs> That's gonna take a while, isn't it? I'm not sure I want to try do it using Gunbreaker to tank for the first time when I've only just started messing with it. With uh, some poor random schmuck. Don't forget, I can always be my white mage. Eh, sure. And you can probably tell me what I'm doing wrong half the time. <laughs> because my level 80, yes. Eh, that sounds like an opportunity to me. Just hurry up with Praetorium so we can move on. Um, unskippable cutscenes, I'm thinking it may be... So you're playing Cutscenes the Dungeon. <laughs> yeah. Let's see, what can I do to keep myself occupied at the time? But, anyway, as I was saying... I could try soloing Desmail, as a mile Darkhold. Um, go up to the gear, should be in the top left. I think I already have it set to there. Double check just to be safe. It has the little party on the party lock icon up there. But I'll check since you suggested it. See, undersized party checked. What is explorer mode? I have no idea. Revisit a dungeon in its completed state. Huh. That would be cool to explore some of them later that way, wouldn't it? I mean, if you really loved a particular dungeon and wanted to, perchance, experience just what it is... And it's full without any monsters in it. Yeah. All right. Let's just see how much I get my ass kicked trying this.
This ought to be rich. You know, I kind of like the layout of OBS bat having that back again. Let's just gather up a bunch of the enemies and then AoE them to death. I think there's actually any primal gear for the uh, for the dancer or gun blade, is there? There's no. Ah. I'm not sure. Okay, I guess that Magitek terminal doesn't need to be messed with. Your eyes on me attack didn't do shit, Bugly. to sit in this thing? It's not showing any indicator. Oh. Do I have to do all the terminals? Um, technically no. There's some of those that only open side areas. Okay, I see. Here we go. Die, 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 die. will give me the Moogle tombstones for killing this dungeon off on my own. I'm not sure if the sync will or not. We'll find out, won't we? If it does, I'm gonna run Arm Veil hundred, like, forty times. Why, because you can do that super fast? Yeah.
I need to get to Feasting Hall next. Time for the big fat dude. Bye-bye. That one's done. If you get Tome, I'm planning to just go through Arm Veil and Synced. We'll admit that the Praetorium is the best at 10 per. Yeah, but is it very efficient? Probably not. In comparison to a Sync Arm Veil party, we're looking at roughly about the same equivalent of time. If we can get the Tombstone Fall unsynced, that changes everything. Oh, I'll certainly report it. Because it still showed the reward when I was looking at it. Oh, don't get me wrong, it's not so much do we get the reward or not, it's if the if the tomes drop while it's unsynced, I'm not going to worry about it, I'm just going to start grinding it. <laughs> so is the itinerant Moogle just only here every now and then or something? Yeah, pretty much. You know you're used to your control scheme when you can press the buttons and realize that you're doing the attack without even thinking about what you're pressing. I'm like, that was my big uh, paladin and gunbreaker. Honestly, I think the only problem with this uh, dual fence, too much tension on the tr triggers. I noticed that as well, but I'm happy with that tension. Because that way you can actually feel that you're pressing it. Hello, who dare? It's a Zenery. Welcome to the stream, Fuzzball. What stream? I don't see anything. I'm on Twitch, dude. Speaking of which, hang on. I'm gonna do something special. And you might want to fix your background, dude. 
A lot of background noise. That will be required since I am streaming. Uh, I got you. I'll probably do it like this. Text you, bro. Anyway, moving us one moment. There we go. But, yeah, did you get the tomes yeah. or no? I'm checking my uh, log. I don't think I got any drops or tomes. You get it after the boss dies or after you leave? After boss dies, usually. Should be in your inventory, not in your currency. I do not see it, so that may not be possible then. Well, that's bullshit. You almost done? We just hit the Sermit doors. Sermite? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, the manor scale mail is actually pretty. I haven't exactly had a chance to go through and look for the uh, dungeon sets. Let's see, depending upon which dungeon this is, I'm not sure if... Also, I found out that the uh, gun for Machinist that the Infernal Fl Flames has is kind of crazy. I think I've got another like four or five fights, but thankfully they're all chained one after the other after this. Okay, that's good. I wonder if I can get any hides from the dragons in this area while I'm waiting. Worth a look. Also found that I can kite like crazy with the, that once I get the angle right and start spinning around something, I can actually kite things. Mm-hmm. Which I thought you wouldn't be able to do in this game. Then again, what's the point of a ranged class if you can't fight? There is no point. That way. The point of range is to stay away. 
Unfortunately, most ranged classes require you to stand still. Uh, the magic ranged, yeah. creature right there that you're fighting? Yeah. It's supposed to be one of the mounts. Fall down, face go thud. But efficiency wise, I would say just to make it feel like it's going faster, more than likely the arm veil would be the best one. Because it's just plain wacky, is that why? Yeah. How long does the event last? Because I was more in the mood for progressing story, truthfully. March 15th until the newest patch, which is 5.5, .5, and I have no idea when they're really that could be anywhere between a week to two weeks or more. Well, the fact that it requires instancing with a group kind of limits when I can and can't do it. So I have to keep that in mind. Honestly, Arm Veil is probably faster. By far. Because you're not waiting an hour for cutting. You know, maybe they should add those to the things, to a list of things people can choose manually and just shift it based on uh, what they need in the queues. In other words, the people who swore off the leveling thing after a while because they didn't want to get stuck in Satasha again could get goaded into doing it. Sound about right? Yeah. So, so far I've got nearly 300,000 gil from selling off the excess materials I acquired over time. Probably well beyond that because I've been spending it like crazy. Be right back. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to be a little bit longer than I thought, guys. I'm going to go ahead and be right back. I'm going to get a quick snack while they're finishing up the dungeon, and we can run some all.
We're back, guys. I have snack, and they're finishing up their little dungeon run, so we're going to be doing some also. Hello, Crimson. Yep. How are you? You lovely bean. Two more fights. I have grilled cheese and turkey sandwich. But, yeah. What happened was that only one of them was being that oh. toxic. You want to know mm -hmm. what they did? What? Ejected them from the group, the yeah. FC, and the Link Shell. Regot me, added another random that didn't know the fight, and started teaching it. That's funny. That is perfect. Personally, I think every decent FC should basically say that if you do this behavior, we're going to ban you from our guild. Because that pushes well, the new thing players is, away. is that once I was kicked, he's like, okay, can we get somebody who actually knows the fucking fight so we can clear this and I can be done with my shit? That Just that outright selfish behavior. Mm -hmm. That's what pushed their button more than them him force kicking me for not knowing the fight. Expecting someone to know should never be a thing in an MMO that's going to have a good, healthy community, though. What they asked me to do, and they actually waited for me to do it, was... All we want you to do is watch a video once, that way you know... Since you're going in as a tank, there's a mechanic that you need to know about. And we would just want you to watch through for the fight for that one mechanic. It is second phase, very quick. I could even point you to the time. Now, if a raid leader is well ready and well re ready to say, okay, you need to have these mechanics. Here's the pictures, the website with pictures on what you need to look for. Like, I mean, he even sent me to a YouTube of it being clipped of everybody getting stunned, the two markers popping up for the tanks to block a weapon attack. Yeah. And them jumping on the mark by activating them. Mm -hmm. And he's like, watch this. This is something you'll need to do if you're tanking this fight. What, was it one like the one with Sasano with the giant sword? Yeah, only this time instead of it being a giant sword, it's a giant fucking laser. Ah. So it's it was pretty much one of those, oh, this is a Susano mechanic mechanic. He's like, oh, so you Yeah, I know this one. I can work with it. Alright, then we're good. We'll start teaching you the fight. Just pay attention for it. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yes, we need people behaving like that in MMO communities. What's even funnier is that uh, by the time we decided it was time to stop training the fight, we kept getting to the last 10%. Ah, uh, cool. But we were getting through to that point consistently and regularly to the point where we just needed more DPS output. Because he kept raging at that 10% marker. And it wasn't your fault. No. I mean, technically there's a rotation that I could have pulled, like... Uh, there's a rotation I could have pulled to output my DPS because it's an 80 fight. Yeah. And... Ooh. Ooh. Because I was still learning, they weren't trying to encourage me to... Huh. Drop my cooldowns to hammer out that DPS. And that probably could have won us the fight had I been doing that. Hey, it, I typically just use the damage boost I have on a tank off cooldown, usually. Like, every time it comes off the cooldown, I use it. I'm referring to your gnashing fangs here, combo. 
You mean... Warrior? No. Guns are... Gunbreaker. I don't have it equipped right this second. So basically you mean the rotation using your cartridges, right? Yeah. I usually use all that on cooldown. Because I'm not just a tank, I'm supposed to deal damage if I'm in that role too. Because dealing more damage as a tank is never a bad thing. Almost done? They must be I am on damage. the second ultimate fight. So that... After this, it's La Habrea, and then we're done. I thought that was technically a separate fight for Chrysalis. I wish. Chrysalis didn't come directly after, unless they meshed the two up. I'm making funny faces with my avatar. Blip, 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 blip. All I need to do is exist for that. But that was fucking delicious sandwich. Oh, no, I'm glad. You're done? Ah. Uh, ultimate weapon is exploding, minor cutscene, and then La Habre. We'll be done here in a sec. Oh, you mean the La Habrea cutscene? No, there's a little fight where you have to more or less purge him from somebody's body. I don't remember that. I remember it just being a cutscene. You mean Thancred's body? Thancred's. Because currently Tancred is still possessed by uh, La Habrea. You know, you'd think the fourfold feather thing would deal more damage, but I guess not. A fourfold feather? The little combo points you can get up. Oh, yeah. You would think that. It might be something that they're not used to having implemented. Like, there was supposed to be some, some weird setup with Monk that gave you Greased Lightning 4. Sounds annoying, whatever it is. Like, you were supposed to build up your, uh... Grease Lightning to 3, switch to Wind Stance, trigger Grease Lightning to 4, and then you just had to maintain it. Let me guess, it doesn't actually work. They took the mechanic out. They got too obnoxious? Yeah. Just waiting on you to kick their ass. I'm 
really happy with how the uh, Fennec Dragon avatar that I have that I'm being helped with on Neos is work working out so far. Took the Rexium and got the whiskers on it, but I don't think I'm going to have whiskers to put on it if I use a VRM of it, though, even after getting a texture. Probably not, we'll see. Is there any reason to do additional dance steps besides the two that are required? Um, some of them could potentially cause your damage to increase. Some of them could turn into an AoE heal. Lots of mitigation. I guess technical steps just a more advanced version. Uh possible. Oh good, a skippable cutscene. And I got two recommendations. Yay. Send me an invite whenever. So at least I have some sort of goal in mind when I'm playing Dancer now. Basically, work the combos so that I can get the um, get the better versions up, and then get the fourfold feathers and spam them at the opportune moment for AOE. So are you going as Dancer or are you going as Dancing. Gunbreaker? I want to take a break and do some D A DPS, I think. I haven't done it in a while. Am I going to be ideal at it? Probably not, but when I'm looking at this, it doesn't actually seem all that complicated, truthfully. Who, what are the dance partner priorities, though? If you know. Um, depends. Depends on whether I'm doing like a damage buff or a heal or something else. I.e. going through standard step to uh, do stuff. Pretty much. Let's check abilities. What was the dungeon you went through again? Um, when? You mean just the now? That was a male dark hole. It only gives three tones. Well, it was worth testing it. Yeah. Uh, 
time to avoid standing in all of the stupid. Yes. I guess I should just focus on AoEing then. That one right there. The sooner that thing dies, the sooner we have no clusters. So just pay attention and kill it first then, right? Yeah. And we just lost our healer. I can't use dance partner. Fuck. Sad manatee. Are you sure you want me to pull? gonna end well. As you saw how fast the poison ate us. We need the healer. Uh huh. But I need to focus on that plant, I'm guessing, and then kill the po smaller pods. Um. Yeah, relatively. I mean, push comes to shove, I could always. We could technically always just drop out, and I can switch to my level 80 and just rip it and tear. Well, why can't we get a... is it even searching for a new healer? Yeah, it is. Focusing anything. What is it? Uh, it is finding members.
Should I just start pulling things to you? Like an old-fashioned dungeon? This would definitely give you practice for 11. I see he's actually letting me do my job then. Oh no. Now we need a healer. All right, he wants to try it. Oh, I just realized I don't have my limit break. If we kill this thing, I'm going to laugh my fucking ass off. What the devil is going on? <laughs> Ignore the bees, focus on him. Yep. Oh, what a time for him to come in! Disengage with is not fast enough. Is the healer even in here? No, they aren't. What the bloody hell? I don't know what this is over my head. Die, 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 die. Come on, come on. Our healer is here.
That was funny. That was fun. <laughs> Hi, Crimson. The Crimson, they so fluffy. Stupid. Sorry, I didn't see it. This huh? man is desperate to just kill. Huh? Who's desperate? This ninja. Blow it all up! Slicey dicey! Oh, I actually pulled aggro? Wow! God damn. He is... He's been hitting on that bat for a while. No, I said me. I pulled the aggro. Yeah, but he's been hitting on that bat since I came running. What do I do? Attack them? No. Oh, shit. Never mind. There will be one that you do attack. Blue, back away from Sad. Stack on him. Oh, I saw the stack. I see what you meant. He grabs it, and then you stack on you. Right. Blue cannot be stacked on. Slice. 
water green. Do not stack. Correct. Because that's an AOE around him. Okay. Good, I remembered not to run the fuck away. Excellent. And he didn't even get to use the last blue slime. Nice. Greed, practically everything. <laughs> The only thing I don't get to keep out of that are two items. Oh, my load speed will be able to outspeed pretty much everyone unless they have an M2 soon. Man, this ninja is zealous. to reduce it to simplified graphics so I can see the fucking ground. That was the Nin's fault entirely on that one because he wouldn't let me get a decent hate on anything. I really wish I could be giving the damage boost to someone. So basically all the dragons we pissed off decided to come down and play now. Hey, I'm not sure if I'm dealing a lot of damage or not. But I'm having fun. Yeah, so am I. That's kind of irking me, but... Not Treasure Coffer. About that. Yeah, two of them. I get to enjoy the cutscene with you. Yup. The angry bitch. Oh 
Okay, just to give you a good idea, there is a few things you need to pay attention to here. Green comet above your head, you want to take it as far away from the group as possible, usually back to this purple barrier. All right. Um, and really? Wow, dude. Oh! Oh! Ow! You flying and I was just about to uh, mention those. I'm gonna move this over here. And then move away from it? Yep. Unless you really want to take about 3,500 damage. I'd rather not. Whoa, that was by the skin of my teeth. Usually it. Yeah, especially later on. No, 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 get up. What the fuck is wrong with you, you ass? No, he did it right. Okay. Now then. you guys just run away from me. Oh, or what's the, what's the yellow one? Ow. Okay, that's what it is. It's just ow. Yeah. Shatter the wind. Ow. I'm hoping that me using the regen is at least going to keep the healer from having to worry too much about me. Ow. Ow. Everyone's dumping it on that side. That was funny. Better than three differently placed ones. And there we go. Big Angie is dead. Good to go. And done. Success. The answer seemed complicated, but apparently it's just RNG fishing for the abilities.
Yeah, pretty much. I'm sorry I did not get to warn you about everything he would do. I had a fair idea. It was fine. Well? But seen Tiamen is was the last. There are no other dragons nearby. What is happening? Nidhogg, he roars. He knows we're here, then. His fury, it bleeds through the eye. Fear not, I am yet my own master. But that damned worm's wrath burns hotter than flame. Pump the heart of the dragon's homeland, it lies before us. Thus do we add another link to the chain of vengeance. O Saint Shiva, friend of end. To the peak of Somme, at the end of a perilous mountain path.